And many people may be looking to find other ways to get around as gas prices yeah. near or above the $5 mark. Yeah, who Ouch. would have thought we'd have seen this? Yeah, uh, right? CBS 4's Deborah Souverain joins us right now from a gas station in Pembroke Pine to explain what's being done to help. Oh, mercy, looking at those prices behind you at the Wawa. No bueno. Yeah. No, no bueno at all. And guys, there is help on the way, but how soon we see the effects of that help, only time will tell. Now, Candice, you notice the prices. Check them out. Unleaded, just regular, 485 at this gas station in Pembroke Pines. And the Biden administration says they are working to find ways to find remedies to these rising gas prices. Now, with gas prices now over or near $5 a gallon nationally, President Biden called on seven U.S. oil refineries to ramp up production and stop making what he has said is, quote, historical high profit off of Americans. Now, there are four main components that determine the price you pay at the pump but roughly two-thirds of what you pay for is based on the price of crude oil which guys is up 70 percent from last year so we know that American oil companies lead the world in crude oil production but we still consume far more than we make and as the White House looks for solutions financial experts say as gas prices go up expect the price of everything else to also go up for families, we understand gas prices are high. The biggest driver of inflation everywhere is energy prices and how it's flowing through the economy. So even as goods prices are going up, they're really driven by higher energy prices. Now, coming up in our next hour, I'll let you know what else the Biden administration is doing to help reduce gas prices. We're live in Pembroke Pines. I'm Deborah Souverain, CBS4 This Morning.